I'm in the middle of a $450 coaster order, and you guys, this is one of the easiest jobs I've had in months. If you're someone who's looking to start a laser engraving side hustle, or you have dreams of going full time like I've done here, I have five easy and profitable products you can start laser engraving today to bring in some extra cash and jumpstart that business. Before we get started, I want to define the term easy as it applies to this video. Number one, it has a flat engraving surface, so there will be no rotary attachments required. Two, the materials will be compatible with all the most common laser types, those being your diode lasers like the X-Tool D1, the Atom Stack, the Otor, and CO2 lasers like your Glowforge, your Aeon, Boss. Therefore, there will be no metal engraving in this video. And number three, easy to source. All the products you see me working with in this video today are linked in the video description below. You can pick them up easily on Amazon, and when you're ready, you can go directly to Alibaba to buy a bulk wholesale order to really drive that per unit price down and increase your profits. Let's get started. First product and what I'm working on today, and that is drink coasters. I'm assuming I don't need to explain what a drink coaster is, but let's look at a couple examples here. We have the slate coasters. These commonly come in a standard round and square shape, and these are often the big sellers. They're durable, they're really easy to laser engrave, and they have a nice rustic feel to them. Another option I keep in stock are these wooden coasters with a nice lip. A little bit more interesting to look at than just those standard round pieces of wood. I don't know uh, the variety of sizes and shapes these come in, but these engrave really nice. I also have these half wood, half marble coasters. Not something you really see every day and they engrave really easy. Some example pricing, the slate ones I bought are a little over $1 each retail. However, if you wanna order bulk from Alibaba, you can get that price down. Here's a listing showing them in the 20 cent per coaster range. Let's look at how much people are selling these for on Etsy. You can see this shop here, big time seller, 170,000 orders and lifetime sales offering them at $25 for four using a standard template they've created. As far as marketing your coasters go, I highly suggest starting out with smaller orders for your friends, families, neighbors. However, the real money with engraving lower price items comes when you're hitting scale. Most of the time, your setup is gonna be the exact same whether you're doing five coasters, 50 coasters, or 100 coasters, so you might as well try to do the 100 coasters. And that's what I did here with this order for 50 coasters for my local neighborhood association. I charged $8 per coaster with a one-time setup fee. Starting out doing smaller groomsman gift orders and family name engravings is great to get going, but to hit the 50, 100, 500 unit coaster orders, you're going to have to target other businesses, restaurants, breweries, special interest groups, places like that. You might be surprised in just how much business you can get from one of these places. And just to show an example, I came across this picture in a laser engraving group that I'm a part of, and this guy managed to snag a 1700 coaster job. And if he were able to sell those for $10 a coaster, which is doable, that would be around $17,000 in gross revenue. Next up, bottle openers. The model I have here has a nice wooden handle. However, there are so many varieties available, it's hard to even talk about them all in one breath, ranging anywhere from small little keychains all the way up to wall mounted units. The thing with this style bottle opener is the engraving area is pretty small, so you're really only relegated to initials and small logos. The upside there being you can engrave these rather quickly. For pricing, I bought these at a retail cost of roughly $1.25 each, but on Alibaba, the price goes down to 20 to 60 cents each. If we check Etsy to see how people are selling these, you can see this seller here is marking these as wedding favors in set increments of five for roughly $5.50 each. Marketing a product like this would be similar to the drink coasters, you know, the groomsman gift, the wedding favors, home bar enthusiasts. However, you really wanna target the breweries, restaurants, local events, maybe there's an Oktoberfest or something going on in your neighborhood. Again, lower cost items, you wanna target volume to make more profit. The next product is custom metal business cards. Now I know I said there's no metal engraving in this video, however this product is an exception. These cards are actually anodized aluminum and don't require any specialized laser to engrave them. All you're doing is removing the anodized finish, therefore not actually engraving the metal. These blank business cards come in a bunch of different colors, however you always want to make sure to buy the 0.8 millimeter thickness. There are some cheaper cards out there on the market that are thinner but much lower quality. I bought these on Amazon at retail for about $1.40 per card, however on Alibaba you can get these in the 16 cents to 15 cents per card range. If we check Etsy, here's an example of some really nice cards with a real estate agent design. You can see just how high end these cards look when they're done. Looks like they're selling them with a templated design, 10 for 
As far as marketing these cards go, um, they're gonna be more expensive than your standard stack of paper business cards, so I would cater them towards creative professionals. By that, I mean people who have businesses where they are often the front face of the product they're selling. People like real estate agents, designers, fitness instructors, craftspeople. These are the type of customer who are always trying to make a strong first impression. And what would make you stand out more than slapping down a metal business card on the table in front of a potential new client? You know, this could also mean you as a new laser engraving business owner. Hopefully you'll be marketing your services to local businesses and giving them a laser engraved metal business card shows your ability and makes you more memorable. Next up on the list, leather journals. Leather journals are a great product to add to your lineup because they are inexpensive when bought in bulk. There's tons of variety available and you can charge a more premium price than say a drink coaster. There are people out there buying bulk leather journals for $5 a piece and then reselling them with a custom engraving for $50. And that's just something you can't do with a cheaper item. Here's an example of a journal I picked up on Amazon for about $21 retail. However, you can buy these on Alibaba for about three to $7 in bulk. Remember I mentioned that there are people selling $5 journals for $50 with a custom engraving? Here's a listing just like that on Etsy, coming from a star seller with 107,000 lifetime sales in their store. As far as marketing your custom journals go, due to the higher retail price of a custom engraved leather journal, targeting smaller individual sales is actually okay. You don't need to do a high volume of orders just to be profitable. However, if you do wanna target some bulk orders and really make that money, I would go after the bookstores, local gift shops, um, churches, or other religious institutions, any kind of writing special interest groups, places like that, just to name a few. Our final product today is going to be valet trays, often referred to as stash all trays. If you aren't familiar with this type of product, they're often used just for kind of tossing your keys or your wallet to store next to your front door or used to organize toiletries and jewelry in a bathroom. Like the leather journals, valet trays come in a massive variety of sizes and designs and also carry a slightly higher retail price point. Here I have an example wooden tray made from bamboo. And here is a really popular design style made from leather where you can put your engraving on the inside there. Uh, I'll show you my engraving error here, just to show that I still make mistakes after seven years. Uh, big tip, if you have an order for 50 of something, always order at least 55 because you're gonna mess up like I did on this one. <laughs> anyway, I bought these retail on Amazon for about 15 to $20 each. However, they are available on Alibaba for about three to $5 each when you buy them in bulk. Checking these out on Etsy, you can see a wood variety going for around $48 with a custom engraving and a leather variety going for somewhere in the 20 to $30 range. As far as marketing these trays go, they're very similar to the leather journals and that there's more meat on the bone for potential margins. Outside of just posting them on your online store or your Etsy, you can target groomsmen gifts, uh, local gift shops, local bookshops. Uh, local home goods shops, these type of places. You can also think outside the box. Maybe contact your local real estate agents. They often give new homeowner clients a housewarming gift. I know mine did. And what would look nicer than a custom engraved uh, stash all tray with the family's name and the address on there. Honestly, this could work with the drink coasters and bottle openers too. There's just so many angles you can take to make money with your laser engraver. All right, I'm just finishing up the 50 coaster order. Here's a box of the first 25. I have the other 25 sitting on the table over there. I still have to box them up. These came out really nice. Like I mentioned earlier in the video, I charged $450 for 50 coasters. However, that price actually includes more than just the laser engraving you saw. I spent a fair amount of time creating that little graphic that's on top of the coaster. I also had to do the rest of the file prep, the workspace prep, and I still had to pay taxes on top of that. Don't forget your taxes, everyone. So all in all, it's a pretty fair price. I probably could have charged a little bit more, but they are my neighbors, so I gave them the bro price. Now I have to go make a delivery. And that is the end of our five product list for today. I hope that's enough to get you started. I have an entire folder full of these products that I'm gonna be discussing on this channel. So if you're interested in making money with laser engraving, go ahead and tap that subscribe button. We'll be back soon. Thanks for watching.